guys today i'm going to take the canva canva is a, it's a free online free it's a tool which you can use to design uh, different things among them a document a whiteboard a poster instagram posts presentation video client document resume logo facebook posts youtube thumbnail Instagram story, edition, portrait, and uh, last name, story. So today I'm going to show you how to create a poster. So, so I'm going to click on uh, the poster. So having done that, I'm going to take me to the next part where I can now select the poster design plan. So, for instance, let us assume that uh, I want to click this one. So, having clicked that, it will take me to this other part. Then, on this part, now you can paint it the different parts uh, of that poster the way you want your poster to look uh, like. Let me pick this one. Now, assuming that uh, I want my poster to look like this. Uh, there are some of the key things that uh, you must do before going ahead to modify the pre the pre prepared uh, poster. So come on the, on this button, then adjust the size. Make sure that the size that you want is already been uh, adjusted on this part. So you can go with the width and the height based on the inches, or alternatively. That you want to adjust. So let's assume that uh, the one that you want to create is supposed to be the size 1000 and uh, 750 example. So I uh, will adjust that part. So it will take me to this point. So you can see that uh, on this just adjust the the size to a thousand and seven hundred and fifty. So the next part is now to make the entity. Okay. So part. Let us see what the poster that I want to create is based on that uh, that. Uh, As sure. Okay. Okay. And adjust the size. So you can adjust the size on this part. You can increase using this button or decrease using this one. You can also change uh, the style that you want to use. Then uh, the next part, you can also change the color using this button. You can bold, you can iterate your data using this other. Then you can also align. You can also align your data that other part. Then for this one, this one is a uh, give you the listing. Then we have the spacing, the effects. Okay, let us assume that uh, I want to change uh, this one to, to another color like the red. So you can see what has happened. Okay, the next part, let me assume that I want it to be to the other part, so you can uh, change the spacing. You can also move it up and down. Either you can use this button, you can also use it, this other button to tilt, to tilt your item. Okay, let me try to stretch. So, 
Okay, next. This is actually a very simple concept, very simple. So I hope that uh, you are following what I'm doing. It's a very simple thing, as long as uh, So this is how, how you will end up uh, creating. Okay, maybe let us assume that you want to change this part. You want to change uh, the five stars to another thing. So what you are supposed to do on the on the design, you can pick maybe other design that uh, can be used to represent the same thing. Let's try to type a star star logo see some of the, the things that we have okay, let me see so maybe I can uh, delete this one and uh, interchange with the other options that are available okay it is same that uh, this look also not too bad. Okay, so what I've done just click and uh, the whole thing okay let me try to change the color to maybe rend so you can see what will happen so our 
our poster will look like this okay let me change also on this one maybe to another color to color red and also adjust the the size so there goes our our poster so our poster will look like that now assuming that uh, you want to introduce a new text you're supposed to click on uh, this button Okay, let's assume that I want to introduce a text box. So here goes my text box. So I can introduce maybe something else. Let me see. Okay, let me try to delete what is already inside and type like uh, kindly. You can comment or subscribe. Subscri subscribe. Okay, let me try to reduce the size. So it will look like this. Okay, let me change the color to more this color to color like uh, this one. This one is not uh, visible. Let me go for more visible color. Okay. okay, just like that. After doing that, assuming that uh, you want your thing to be like that, you have two options. Number one, you can uh, lock this part to ensure that uh, you don't adjust anything in case you are moving up and down on this particular page or unlock if you want to adjust something on, on your poster. Okay, the next step is to maybe to download. So we have the share option go download then there's this down uh, download button maybe you try to to pick the format that you want to use most of the cases i prefer to use the jpeg because of uh, the nature of uh, the quality output that i'll get so i'll go for the for the jpeg then the, the size that I'm already adjusted, then the quality. Maybe I can adjust the quality to 100. Okay. My. So my page is on page 2. As you can see, this is our page 2. And uh, the page 2 that I have. So go ahead and uh, click the download button. Then there goes your picture will be downloaded to the download. see so there goes so you can see how how our, how our poster looks like so you can uh, try to do as many adjustments as possible in case that uh, in case you're not satisfied with the results that uh, that you get okay so thank you in case you have any question don't forget to comment in case you need to get more clarification how to use the Canva I'm available so don't forget to subscribe support the channel so that you can continue learning together thank you have a lovely day